What's up folks? Today is the day for you to get out of your own way. Today is the day to get out of your own mind and get out of your feelings as well. What am I talking about? Starting now. Not waiting till the beginning of the year. Not waiting until next week after Thanksgiving, after Christmas. Not waiting on the day, on the moment that you start to change your life because nobody's gonna do it for you. I've created an entire playlist on this channel. It's linked right up here that you can go to and you can see everything, that you can hear everything that you need to know in order to lose weight. An entire playlist dedicated to that. I would highly suggest that you go and watch that and take notes and listen to what I'm telling you because I've dedicated my life to tell you how you can change your life. But that's the whole thing right there. You gotta do it. Nobody's gonna put a gun to your head. And guess what? If you wait, because right now, first week of November, if you wait all the way till January to get started, there is a very good likelihood that you are going to fail come January. And come February, you're gonna be right back in your old routine doing the exact same thing and you're gonna go in the same pattern over and over and over again. Right now is a time to start getting mentally prepared for this. I mean, you literally might not be ready to come in this gym and literally start putting in that work, but being mentally prepared for this, you can start that right now and you should. Why? Because if you don't start to prepare, then you're preparing to fail. Ever heard that one before? It's a true story. How can you start preparing your mind? You can start becoming more conscious of what you're putting into your body. You can start weighing yourself and actually looking at the weight that you're putting on every single day or not losing or whatever. You can start actually taking into account the things you eat, your weight, taking progress pictures so you can actually see for yourself what you look like because that's the number one thing that we avoid. We don't want to know how much we weigh. We don't want to know how much we eat. We don't want to know what we actually look like without clothes on. But those are the very things that will start catapulting us into the future. And those are the things you can start right now. We have to start right now because if you don't, you're setting yourself off to fail. You're setting yourself off that cliff before you even get there. Like the floor is just becoming not a firm foundation for you. It's becoming that rocky slope. You have to start fresh. You have to start new. You have to start off right. And starting off by th putting things off, that's never going to make uh, progress happen in your life. Nope, it never will, it never will. It doesn't matter if you are a mom, if you are a dad and you're overweight, or if you're scrawny and you just want to put on muscle. It doesn't matter if you're an athlete that just got done playing football like my boys. It doesn't matter what kind of situation that you're technically in. Maybe you play semi-pro football. I don't know your actual situation, but I guarantee you, if you're taking weeks and months and all this time off, for, and most of the time, people take this holiday season off because they want to eat. That's their number one reason. Because they don't want to give up Thanksgiving, they don't want to give up Christmas, and most of the time, I can't say every single time, but most of the time, people are more lazy around this time of year. This is the time when they're like, you know, when, like winter break is here. They don't want to go home from college and start working out and all this stuff. They don't want to get off of school and do all this hard work, but they still got these big dreams and these big aspirations. And I'm like, well, what do you really want? Do you want to be lazy? No, Keith, well, maybe. Do you want to be fat? No. But I don't really care right now. Do you want to feel like you feel every single day? No, not really. Then do something about it. Then absolutely do something about it. And the first thing, like I just said, start becoming more self-aware. What you look like, how much you weigh, and what you're putting into your body. When you start seeing that stuff, and you start recognizing, wow, I'm overeating. Wow, I'm actually, you know, I'm not making any progress in this life. I'm just kind of doggy paddling in this cesspool of this thing called earth. Then maybe it'll start triggering on in your mind. Wow, I got to do something about this because that's what it comes down to. You got to do something about it. You got to do it for you and you got to do it for those people around you. 
Because I guarantee you, if you are well over 300 pounds right now, you are putting more stress than what you need on your heart. And guess what? Your little girl needs you, your little boy needs you, your fiance, your kids, your people around you, your family, your pets, they need you. So quit putting your life at risk. Quit putting yourself in jeopardy. You're putting your heart at risk. You're making your body work harder than what it needs to. Just because you want to not do anything. Today's that day to shake off all that stuff. Like you are made for more than this. God made you for more than just excuses. We got to like actually live up to our calling and being living up to our calling is not sitting on the couch every day, feeling sorry for ourselves, thinking of all these things that we wish we would have done. Start now. I mean, look at, look at it this way. If you start right now, this is the first week of November, average healthy, average healthy weight loss. Two pounds per week, four weeks in November, four in December, then there's like a half week in there. So let's just say eight weeks. Eight times two is 16. You could be 16 pounds lighter come January. And like I've told you before, it takes eight to 12 weeks just for all this work that you're doing in this gym and beyond. Eight to 12 weeks just for you to start like recognizing those results. It takes the eight to 12 weeks for it to get from your body to your mind, almost like the unveiling of your eyes. So think about that. Eight weeks you have from right now until January, and you could lose 16 pounds, let's just say that average weight loss, but maybe you wanna be more than average, maybe you wanna go above average, maybe you'll lose 20, that'd be sick. Even if you only lost 10, that's 10 pounds. You've already gained progress before the gym starts filling up in January. You already got your routine down packed and you're making an impact in your own life and those around you for two whole months before January even gets here. So you're not really going to quit when it's, things get hard in January and the gym is packed and you got all these excuses and it's snowing outside and it's cold. No, because you've been coming for two freaking months. You pushed through Thanksgiving, you pushed through Christmas, you lost weight, and now you're feeling great. January comes around, you are ready to go. Are you preparing for victory or, or are you preparing for failure? That's my question to you. So start right now. Start right now. Make sure you check out uh, How to Lose Weight playlist. It's going to be at the very end of this video, so don't miss that. It was also linked in the video earlier than that, and it's in my playlist here on my channel. So go check that out on How to Lose Weight. Everything you need to know. A lot of time, heart, and effort into that playlist for real. So go check that out. Start now. If you need somebody online or in person to get you going, because this is what I do. I help people transform their lives, literally. It's a, it's a partnership, it's you and I. Email me right now, it's right there on the screen. And we can get this rolling, whether you are in Australia or maybe you're right here in Worcester, Ohio. Let's go. But I want you to have an amazing day. Start today. Everything's going to change. Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Have a good day. Like and subscribe. This is Woo.